Nothing came, e- nothing came easy after that. Yeah, it was about. Um, you know, we dressed up a couple of plays in there to get some chunk things going, and, and uh, we were able to do that. Uh, and then from there, when you just needed to try and piecemeal some uh, yards together and get drives, you know, we just wanted to do it, you know, not on, on a consistent basis. So, um, you know, we've got to go back to the drawing board a little bit and find out, uh, you know, how we can get the ball in, in certain playmakers' hands and, and go from there. Hey Derek, it was reported on TV that Spencer didn't practice all week. How do you think that influenced things? That's a that's a, a boss man question. That's above my pay grade. Did you have a two point play set up? If Mike had said, "Let's go for two. Absolutely, always do. Always have a bunch of them, especially with the new rule now, college football, where you have to have you know several of them just in case. Did, did you have one you're fairly confident in? Um, <clears throat> Yeah, I mean it's it's good. I mean we wouldn't draw it up, you know, if we didn't really like it. But but um, you know I think uh, coach is feeling that our kicker's pretty good, and, and what we had going was pretty good, and, and uh, so you know that was just the, the choice that was made. Mike kind of pinpointed the the rushing offense. So maybe where it was a little lacking today for you. Do you do you feel that way? And uh, is there was there a cause that you saw that, that maybe the rushing game went where we need, need to be? Oh uh, yeah, obviously I'd like to rush the ball better than what we did. Um, you know, again, I've got to go back, look at it, see what what happened, um, and I can't really expand too much on it without knowing exactly what what the issues were. Um, you know, they did a good job. You know, when you see them, they did a good job of, of uh, rushing the football, and I think that was the difference in the game. You know, if we could get that part of it going, uh, then we were rolling. So we'll go back, take a look. You guys are rolling pretty good there early. What adjustments did they make that that slowed you guys down? Not a whole lot. I mean, it's not that they adjusted. It's just, you know, you kind of have your, your play set, and, and uh, we had some chunks that we wanted to get to. And, uh, we had a, a bunch of calls that we really liked that we got to and, and needed early, and, and uh, some of them we hit, some of them we didn't. You know, there were times that um, I feel like we probably could have capitalized on some of the calls in there, and, and for whatever reason, it just didn't hit, and uh, we weren't able to, to continue to move the ball down the field. Um, and, you know, so to answer your question on that, it's, it's one of those things. I don't think that they really took anything away just from an adjustment standpoint. It's just we didn't make that certain player, that certain call in that situation. You guys lost on the road last year. Big 12 regular season. You still get to Arlington. Is there any panic in that locker room right now? I don't think so. Um, you know, we've got a tough road ahead of us, and this is this is a pretty good stretch. You know, we know that. Um, we're playing, obviously, TC today, who's ranked and undefeated, and then you got Texas next week, and I'm not certain what happened in their game, but... Um, and then uh, following that, I think we have K-State. So it's a, it's a pretty good haul uh, for this month without a, without a uh, open week. You feel like you're letting everyone get away. 17-point lead in the first half, 14-point lead in the fourth quarter. Absolutely. I wish we could have, you know, just put the hammer down and finished it. You know, I'm really disappointed. And, and uh, you know, obviously myself and, and what we did on offense. And, and uh, we just got to find a way to, to finish that thing off. You know, we had, we had some chances in there. And, um, you know, we just didn't move the ball well enough. Uh, in the second half, and, uh, you know, like you said, we started out pretty good early, and I thought, okay, this thing's going to be super solid. And then, uh, and really, I felt like we moved the ball coming out in the second in the second half too. And we went down the field and, and stalled out on, on a field goal, um, and that could have been the difference right there. You know, we've got to find a way to get touchdowns, not field goals. And uh, you know, they did the same thing, just uh, came out on top in in the end. Okay, so when, you, when you're looking at, at trying to get the uh, the run game going, do you see that there's going to be the obvious benefit of, of opening things up more more in the passing game when you do? Oh, no question. You know, we've got to get uh, those guys more in the box and trying to stop the run, and, and we've got to take advantage of it, though. You know, they played us in some man today, and, and uh, we've got to make plays out there. You know, we've got to go and rip it down the field, and, um, you know, it is what it is. I mean, it was, it was a long week of practice, let's put it that way. And um, you know, I'm really happy with how our guys came out today and played. I mean, they played hard and uh, gave ourselves a chance to win. And uh, we just didn't come out on top. But trust me now, I'm telling you, they played their ass off today, and all things considered. Thank you, Spencer.